instructor at the Monterey Sports Center bringing the gym to you in another video that you can do on your own time in your own home. Today's workout is a 20 minute super express best of 2020 legs. The only equipment you need is a chair or a sofa bag or a table or a countertop. We're going to use that mostly for balance and we'll get deeper into our legs. But these are some of the best exercises from 2020 workout videos. If you like my videos, please subscribe, lower right hand, lower right hand corner. You can also send me comments and you can share. I love that. All right, we only have 15 to 20 minutes. The best thing about the Super Express is they're 15, 20 minutes max. The fast, they're effective. You can do them alone or you can couple them with other workouts to have the type of workout that you want. Easy to follow, easy to modify. All right, so let's get started since we only have about 15 to 20 minutes. As I said, I'm going to use the chair, but if you've got a countertop, the back of a sofa, that works. Let's start by warming up our calves. Put your feet together and just lift your heels up and down. Lift up, down, up, down. Now, if you grab onto the countertop or chair, you notice that will help you a little bit with stability. And just make sure that you can focus on the move. Okay, let's do eight more. We're going to warm up with our calves, and then we're going to warm up a little bit with our bum and our quads in four, and then we get a full fun things for you. In two, now I want you to go faster. Let's go faster. Okay, up, up. Come on those toes. Now, the other thing about this workout, you don't have to have shoes. I have shoes because I like the extra support for my toes and my arches, but you absolutely can do this bare feet or stocking. A lot of the moves are from bar, B-A-W-R-E, which means many times we don't wear shoes at all. Now I want you to leave your heels up, leave your heels up and press down, press, press. So I'm pressing down with the heels and I'm staying on my toes the whole time in that ball. And I'm pressing, pressing. You should feel this in your hamstrings and your calves. Two more sets of eight. One, two, three, four, Shake it out. All right, if you want, you can do a little stretch. Okay, the one thing about the super express, we don't do it at a lot of warm up, cool down, or stretching, but if you need it, please take the time to do that and do what works for you. Okay, we're going to start now with our bum. So I'm going to face my chair, I'm going to take my foot towards you back, I'm going to point that toe, core tight, and I'm going to lift and lower. So lift. Lower. So I want to feel all the movement in my bum as well as the hamstring lift, lower, lift, lower. Good. Now my body is straight. Good. Lift, lower. I'm going to get that hamstring and that big bum muscle. Lift, lower, lift. Now keep going, but flex the foot. So flex it. Good. Flex. Flex. Good. Get that core tight. Lift. 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 Good. Eight more. Like I said, the point of the chair or the table or the countertop is it just helps you be able to focus on the move. Lift. Lower. Lift. Now, same thing with your feet. Don't change it. Pulse the still time. Just make your pulse. 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 You get a little bit more. Kind of activating that muscle. You notice my foot on the floor, that leg can be bent a little bit. Okay? It's all about working in the front leg. Two more sets of eight, seven, six, five, four, three. You got eight more. Just squeeze that bum. Now, what you can do is keep that foot flexed. You're going to put that knee forward and pulse up and down forward. So lift, lift. Now, what we've done. Now we're working on this quad, okay? My foot is flexed, which means I'm contracting that muscle, lifting it down, make sure you're standing up straight. If you want more, you can nice grab a weight and put it on that leg if you choose. Now let's do eight more here. Good, keep going. Now hold this leg stable and little kicks. Kick, kick. Time to the limit is all about Contracting that quad muscle. Good. Push. Push. Good. Keep it straight. Core tight. Two more sets of eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight more. Now we've got one more exercise for that quad. All right. In four, three. Point that toe. Without that pulse, I'm 
down, pop, pop, so let's see, up and down, good, you should feel it right here in your quad, lift, 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 try to point that toe, that just contracts the muscle in a different way, two more sets of eight, eight one, two, three, four, five, six, last eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, good, Shake it out. Let's do a little stretchy. Okay, so you might feel it in your quad. So this front leg, let's grab that ankle, hold it back. Bring your knees together, just hold that stretch. A little stretch. Good. And because we need to really stretch those calves before, take that same leg back, press the heel into the floor, go backward forward, bend that back knee. Just let that stretch go all the way through your calf as well as through your hamstring. All right, we're gonna go the other side. So, let's go right into it. Now, front foot back, point the foot and lift, lower, lift, lower, lift, lower. So find that angle where you can feel it in your bum. You also should feel it in that hamstring. And it's a little bit of that hip flexor. Lift, lower, lift, lower. Good. Lift, lower, lift, lower. The other foot can be bent a little now. Flex the foot, keep lifting, flex it. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Good. So we're going to get all sides of our legs in this 15 to 20 minute workout. Okay, eight more here. Eight. And the beauty of it is you really don't need any equipment. You just need something to balance on or to hold on to. Four more like this. That foot is flexed. Plus two and pulse it here. Pulse it. Pulse. Pulse. Flex that foot. As you flex it, you want to feel a little bit more in that back hamstring. Flex. Flex. Good. Keep going. Two more sets of eight. Here's one. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Now, eight more now. You're going to keep that foot flexed. Four more, and you're going to bring it knee forward, and you're going to pulse up and down. Knee forward, pulse up, up, up and down. So we changed it from the bum and the hamstring to that quad. Okay? Lift me. Lift. Lift. Keep it flexed. And like I said, if this doesn't do it for you. The other thing you do is grab a heavy weight and just put it on that way to give you a little bit more intensity. All right, now hold the leg stable and little tiny hip pulses. Hip, hip. So this is a kind of a workout. We're staying kind of the deeper, the deeper moves after getting done with these workout warm up moves. Two more sets of eight, and maybe one, two, three, four. But we're going to be doing more in our philosophy hamstrings. Eight, seven, six, five, four more. Then you're going to point that toe and go back to that pulse up and down. Pulse it, pulse, pulse, pulse. So you're getting little pulses, or a little bigger. And really think about this muscle. Keep your chest open, core tight. Two more sets of eight. One, two, three, four, five.
chest up, we're going to go down. Four counts, how much you go as low as you can go. So we're going to four, three, two, and back up. Four. Now, all the pressure is in that front heel, okay? You should feel it. Notice that knee doesn't come forward. Now let's do singles, down and up. So singles, down, up. Pushing your back heel. Now if you feel this in your knee, a couple things you can do. One is sit back a little bit more. Second thing you can do is not go quite as low, but make sure it doesn't hurt your knee. Give me eight more singles. Down, straight, down. Good, now four more. Four, three, two. Now, I want you to slowly go down. Go down, find that spot where you're as low as you can go. You can rearrange yourself if you need to. Hold it here. Hold it for eight, seven. Now we're going to go singles up and down. Three small singles. Are you ready? Here we go. Up and down, little. One, two, one more. Now one all the way up and down. Up and down. Got it? So three small ones. All the way up and down. On four. Here's three. Two. Come on, all the way up and down. Here's number four. One big up and down. You've got four more like that. Little tiny up and down. One. 
about the knee. It's all about the heel. Head it to the end. Small and big. Four more, please. Four. And up. Three. And up. Two more. One more, one more. And now you can come your pulses. Take it as low as you can get the pulse in. 60, 15, kid. Over here. Chest open. You can do it. You can do it. Eight more. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Go. Shake it out. Okay. You only got about four more minutes. So if you need to stretch, you can stretch your quads. Our hamstrings out. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to incorporate those calves, but we're going to do the inner and outer thigh. And I'm just going to move my chair. The best thing for this is you might want to be facing your chair or your countertop. I want you to be able to see me. So I'll show you. So the first thing you're going to do is we're going to put our heels together and come up on our toes. Now, if that's uncomfortable for any reason, you can absolutely go more into a sumo or a plie because let me show you what you're going to do with this. We're going to come up on your toes and you're going to go down into a squat with your knees up. If that bothers your knees, you can do a normal squat or you can wind your legs. Okay? Are you on your heels? Let's try. Squat down for count. So take it down. Two, three. Your knees go out and then you come back up. Squeeze it. Take it down again. Four. Three, two, and come back up. Now let's do that slow one again. Do it again slow. The whole goal is to get as low as you can, so you use that chair or counter to let you go slow. And if you need to lean back a little bit to help your knees, you can do that. All right, let's try our singles. Are you ready? Here we go. So down, up. Now I've got my heels up through the whole thing, okay? So I'm working my calves. And I'm also getting outer and inner leg. I'm trying to go as low as I can. Give me eight. Your chest open in. Bum goes back to make sure you're not pushing those knees. Four more. So you know what's coming up. We're going to do something we did in those lunges. All right, now I want you to go down, go down low. Go down low. Okay, try to get lower. As low as you can go. Hang on to that table or that chair. Try to keep your heels up with it. Your feet are together apart now. Tiny little singles up and down. Give me three. Two, one more. Now all the way up and down. Ooh. Again, tiny ones. Three. Two. Come all the way up. Squeeze that bum. Take it down again. Three. Two. Good. Your knees are wide. All the way up and down. This is from that inner and outer thigh. Really good for the hips. Good. Up and down. We do four more like that. Take it three, two, one. Up and down. And again. Three, two. Jack below. Up and down. Okay, two more times. Three, two. All the way up and down. Squeeze it. One more time. And then we just got some singles. And we're done with this workout. You can do it up and down. Okay, one of each. We got eight to finish. And up. So one and one. So the key with this again is that within 15 to 20 minutes, we try to get everything. We're using chairs or tables to try to go lower and deeper. It's called a bar workout. Just in case we're kind of using it and incorporating those moves. One more. All right, how oh, can you give me pulse it, pulse it to finish? 16, because you know, we have to go out and make it strong. Okay, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, plus two, last one. Come up, shake it out. All right, so again, same kind of stretch as we did initially. If you have to go, you can go. Make sure you walk around, do your stretches as needed. Okay, this is your workout. Add this workout to other workouts. Do it by itself. Please subscribe, share, send me comments. Let me know what you like. We got the other leg coming up. Most important, what I want to do is tell you, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay active. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.
Bye-bye.